I'm winning the Impact World Championship at Slammiversary. Slammiversary, Saturday, July 15th on Pay-Per-View. Dango is absolutely right. Heath is just sucking up to the DOA. Ah, uh, stop it, Heath. Trying to wake people up, doing the right thing, especially by Santino, who's got Dango following Slammiversary in Windsor. Ladies and gentlemen, the following contest set for one fall, introducing first, accompanied by and representing the design, Angel! Very curious to see if Angels falls in line with Diener and the rest of the design. Get ready to rock like never before. Brace yourself for the mind-blowing premiere of the new show here on Access TV, Marty Music Guitar Academy, the ultimate destination for aspiring rock guitarists. So tune in July 11th at 8 Eastern for the show that will put your guitar skills over the top. His opponent from Atlanta, Georgia, Jonathan Crasher. Well, this right here is about to be not only a huge test for Angels, but a test for this man, too, as these guys are going to give us a little preview of the ultimate X match come Slammiversary. Yeah, one week from Saturday, July 15th in Windsor, Ontario, Canada, live on pay-per-view, Fight TV, and DAZN internationally at Slammiversary. It's a multi-man ultimate X match. The winner gets a guaranteed future X Division title shot at the time of their choosing, both Gresham and Angels involved in that matchup. And frankly, I don't know exactly what's going on between the design. Angels and Diener have butted heads a lot as of late, but I think Angels and Gresham would be X Division championship stars. I mean, there's no doubt about it. We're just talking about talent, but at the very start of this whole thing, you talked about doing the right thing. I know Diener is hoping Angels will do the right thing and win this one for the design, go on to slam, and potentially bring that title opportunity to the design. Bring it home to the family. This is a first time ever matchup here and a lot of love shown by the fans here in Atlanta as both Gresham and Angels are from right here in Atlanta, Georgia. Oh, and a single leg drop kick. Let's not forget, Ray Wall, in July of last year, Angels made his impact debut challenging then X Division champion Mike Bailey for the title in this building. Already, the, the fissures are rather obvious in this matchup. We thought they were coming in here 100%. Apparently, that's been proven wrong already. Oh, oh suplex there. Angels into the cover against Gresham in a kick out. Remember two weeks ago here on Access TV, Jonathan Gresham and Mike Bailey defeated Khan and Angels in tag team action. And that's where things really erupted between Diener and Angels. That was mounting frustration following their loss to OVE on Against All Odds. Uh, he was someone like Diener who's had such tight control of this group. He feels himself starting to lose it. And for some people, it just makes you want to hold on oh. even tighter, which sometimes causes even more problems oh. than it's worth. Beautiful drop kick by Jonathan Gresham, the former world champion. Angels is in trouble. Diener saying to Khan, let him be. Can Angels get back in this against Jonathan Gresham here in Atlanta? Oh, and the action continues here in Atlanta between Jonathan Gresham and Angels. It's been all Jonathan Gresham through the commercial break. And there's obviously been some problems within the design and the communication between Diener and Angels. Yeah, the interesting thing to me was at the beginning of the match, it was Angels, it was Diener barking oh. orders and Angels being a little perturbed by it. Cover by Gresham, hook to the leg and a kick out by Angels. Another cover and a kick out. Gresham goes for a third cover, Angels still alive. The intensity, the sense of urgency from Gresham, I, I love it, but it was Diener barking the orders, trying to maintain control. It was Angels wanting to do it on his own, on his own. And finally, when there's an opportunity, Diener eventually, when Diener, excuse me, when Angels is on the back foot, Diener says, no, 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 let him be. Diener continues to shout, fall in line to Angels, wants Angels to do exactly as Diener tells him. And now, 
Gresham looked like it was setting up for a suplex. Goes after the midsection of Angels. Well, you have to imagine Diener is on edge after the whole issue with Callahan. He must be shook, and that does not go away easily. He wants to maintain control by any means necessary, but hold on too tight, and sometimes it just breeds resentment. Shot right to the midsection. He's going for a suplex again there. Angels is trying to drop his body weight against the very compact Jonathan Gresham, and that just ticked off the foundation, <laughs> Jonathan Gresham. Getting a little more hard hitting out again, struggling for everything here. Both guys working hard, trying to counter the other here, working for everything they're oh. getting here. Ah, right, now Angel's trying to get Gresham off his feet. This a stalemate here, going for a suplex. Back and forth, the strength, the conditioning to just keep fighting against your opponent. Wait, wait, wait. Oh, Gresham wanted to go back to the midsection and a kick out off the sunset flip. And down goes Gresham off the hip toss and Angel's able to withstand that altercation. You didn't hear much of Diener during that. It seemed like Angel's was operating on instinct. What do you think? I mean, you, you absolutely have to. Again, once the bell rings, especially in a one-on-one -on -one scenario, oh. Diener, he is not in this matchup. You sometimes, you just gotta let your guy do his thing. And right oh. now, Angels is certainly doing his thing. Half and half suplex there by Angels. Diener yelling, finish him now. You almost saw a look there from Angels over to Diener. Yeah, my interpretation is, this is how I'm gonna do it. Kind of like, I got this. Oh, and to the chest of Gresham. Angels, beautiful Northern Lights suplex. Great bridge, kick out by Gresham. Impact Wrestling is truly worldwide in 2023. Get your tickets now at impactwrestling.com. You can see at the bottom of your screen, Slammiversary, Chicago Heat, Multiverse United 2, Emergence, Victory Road, our 1,000th episode, and Mid-South Mayhem, all coming your way soon. Shoulders down, here's a cover by Gresham trying to put away this Ultimate X preview. Well, now Gresham, shoulders down, Angels couldn't end the match. And now Grush, backslide, backslide. Whoa! Oh, oh trying to turn it around, up. shoulders down. Shoulders down here on Angels. Angels trying to finish Gresham. Another cover. Angels and Gresham going back and forth. Oh my God. It's a little bit of a wheelbarrow scenario here. Back and forth. Who's going to get the uh, one? Whoa, whoa, wait. Oh, wait a minute. Angels. Angels nearly pinned Gresham. Both guys. Moving around like a fish out of water there. Now it's Gresham looking to tie Angels up. Oh, now Gresham bringing Angels oh. down for the octopus. Angels taps out. He had no choice. Here is your winner, Jonathan Gresham. Did you see the way Jonathan Gresham not only tied up and locked in that octopus stretch, but absolutely drove Angels down to the mat with the intensity. That could be a little preview of what we see come Slammiversary at Ultimate X. One week from Saturday in Windsor, Ontario at Slammiversary. The winner of the Ultimate X match earns a guaranteed future X Division title shot at a time of their choosing. Gresham and Angels will be in that matchup, and Gresham showing a lot of praise here for Angels despite Diener's frustration. Diener clearly none too pleased. An extended hand here from the foundation to Angels. You can't imagine Diener wants to see this go down.
Looks like a decision made by Angels. And listen, Tina was even trying to sit Khan on Angels. Khan trying to play Peacekeeper here, but Tina is irate. Tina's starting to lose it when it comes to control of the design.